people, welcome to another edition of that finger tapping frenzy that we all know and love as WWE Supercard with me, Big Jim, here at Bad Lad Dad HQ. Now then, it's about time I checked in with you good people. I'm sorry, look, I've been a bad friend. I know I've been a bad friend. It's been a while since I've been in touch. But I want to hear from you guys. I want to hear how you're getting on. Are you still whacking away in the wonderful world of WWE Supercard? Or are you just thinking... Ah, oh, wait for the next tier, wait for the next season, wait for the next year, I don't know, how are you getting on? For me, it's been a bit of a battle, as some of you know, I work for a sports media company, and of course, sport takes place a lot of the time at the weekend. When the WWE Supercard like to do their events at the weekend, which isn't good for me in terms of a playing point of view, but it's very good for me in a work point of view, because I obviously love sport, and I'm very happy with the job that I do, so... Not complaining, I'm just saying that's the reality of the situation. So, what I'm going to do today, just by way of saying hello again, is just collect my drops. Um, and I'm, I know all of you know what drops are by now, um, but those drops are, of course, the things that you got from watching all the Twitch streams uh, that have been going on for the last few days. And um, good to see some old faces uh, in action and kind of being rewarded. Uh, with this opportunity to give out some QR codes by WWE Supercard, uh, which have been very useful, obviously, for getting uh, more drops for us that need to collect them to get these uh, these new souped-up uh, former Season 1 and Season 2 cards, uh, now nicely repackaged for WrestleMania 21. Uh, but yeah, good to see some old faces. Biggie Dude, the, the original MVP, Biggie Dude, doing his thing on Twitch. And uh, Tom, aka FunkyTown49, a five-hour stream, that's not an easy thing, people. That is really not an easy thing. Doing a 10-minute video is bad enough. I mean, look at me, I've done it for about six months, all year, perhaps. I don't know, lost count. But yeah, doing a 10-minute video is uh, hard enough in itself. Doing an hour stream, or even a two-hour stream, that's yeah, pretty tough going. A five-hour stream without a break, that is tough going. So uh, props to those people. Tip of the hat to those people uh, for doing that. But anyway... The good thing is, for me, um, and I'm sure for a lot of you as well, is they have now landed in my account. I've already, let's have a quick look and see where I stand. As you can see, I've got some pros I can do there. Um, we'll just go into the main account and see what cards I've got. One event. One event is all I've been able to complete uh, so far. I did start to do single cards on weekends when I wasn't so busy work-wise, but then I just got to the... I got to the what's the point kind of scenario. Yes, it's nice to get the images, um, but I'm sure they'll uh, crop up in later giveaways or whatever. I don't know. We'll see. But anyway, look, that's what I've got so far. Local talent. I didn't get that. Didn't get that when uh, there was that glitch in the game all those years ago, for those of you who've been playing for some time, when you could just dip into some images for a few days. can't remember how long it was for. It was a glitch for a little while anyway, when you could get in and you could just nick any image from the past. So I missed out then, so I'm really pleased I've got uh, local talent. So I've got the opportunity for a local talent pro, but to be quite honest, it would be nice to have one each of the other cards. Having just said, um, I don't go for those single event cards, what's the point? I'm now saying, yes, I would like to get those single drops. So there's nothing like consistency in making your mind up with these things, but it's only a game after all. Um, so let's go in and collect these bits and pieces. Uh, from my rewards section. There's no messages there. Oh, uh, just to point out, um, when it comes to Team Bad Lad Dad, see, I haven't changed. I love a little sidetrack. I love to just go down a, another little avenue. Um, if we uh, go into Team Bad Lad Dad uh, and just see the team there, Zim BLD, he's the man to contact about Team Bad Lad Dad. Uh, Zim BLD, he's your man. He's the man who's sorting out the teams and the lineups and everything. Um, and just to point out that I myself am not even in my own team uh, right now. I'm there in the squad. I'm in the squad, just lurking, ready for action for whenever I'm ready. Uh, but I've just not been ready. So I'm not in team battleground or anything at the moment. And Zim's the man. So I, I do appreciate the messages you send me saying, uh, Jim, can I be in your uh, team and all, all that kind of shizzle? What am I going to there for? Um, but I'm really, again, I don't have time to control that type of thing. So uh, Zim is the man who is in control. He's the man with the power. He's the building man with the power. Uh, right, what's he doing? 
back to the massages rewards I've just got a few giants rewards to collect I just chiseled it for a bit because of Shinsuke I already had Shinsuke as a pro these are going to be a waste of time aren't they um, so it was useful to get him to make him uh, uh, an F1 just fortify him up for the game these really are going to be a part of dross aren't they uh, Shimus. I haven't played him. I probably haven't got the single though. I'm already chewing off um, all these. Right, let's get these twitch drops in action. Ten. It looks like that. Yes, I know I did. It looks like they're all here. I could have done this beforehand, but then um, I didn't. <laughs> so there. You're going to have to watch me do it. Uh, if you want to watch the video, if you want to watch the video, you've got to watch me do my thing. Basically. That should be uh, a couple of 50s when we're there. Oh, there's another 30, is there? All right, okay. I think I've got about 19 uh, since I collected my original local hero. Uh, right, any predictions? Quickly think your predictions. What am I going to get? Am I going to get a local hero pro, and am I going to get two of the same thing? I'll have enough, I'm assuming, for two collections. In action, right, collectibles. What have we got? 239, yeah, right, so we're going to get two. Um, I'd be interested to hear, actually, if, did any of you do these 25 token packs? Because there's a lot of uh, there's a lot of lower cards available there, and I'd be pretty miffed to get some of those, to be quite honest. I think I've got all of those images anyway. Um, so we'll, we'll come out of that. And, and we'll do the big, the big thing that we want to do. So, Roman Regains is going to be Roman. Uh, is it going to be a Mr. Sinar with his belt? That's I don't have that image. That would be nice. Or local talent pro. I'd also be interested to hear um, those of you who proed these up, who've, who've had these and who've made a pro out of these. What's the strength like? Are they good? Are they not so good? I would like to know. Let me know down below in the in the comments section. Right here we go. Number one. Recipe number one. The arts. And it is. Roman Regains! That's nice. I do have that image. I do have that image, but it's a 21 card, so not going to knock it. Let's just lock it down. Not going to knock it, and going to lock it. Got to lock it. Have, have you dusted anything from uh, WrestleMania 21? Uh, uh, WrestleMania 21? SummerSlam 21. Uh, yeah, I managed to call the tier by the wrong name at least once a video. Veterans of these videos will know that. But then again, I do talk rather quickly when I'm doing these. Yes, I do want to buy another one. Let's have a look. It's a pro. It's a local talent pro. And I'm already going, oh, I don't have the Cena image now. Which is going to encourage me to play some more so I can get some more of those uh, drop tokens um, uh, to get that Cena image. So where are we in general? Let's make sure they're just trebly making sure they're locked down. Yeah, they're both locked down. So we're going to get a local hero pro out of it. So that's another reason for, for playing for a bit. Um, let's have a look at the old team ringed on. The team is uh, battling away there. We've already got um, AJ Styles. You can see the uh, the top performers there for this week. Uh, good lads. Good lads. Good to see you. Um, and just to finish off with a bit, I'm going to have a lot. I'm not going to do any not packs. I haven't bought a pack for, for quite some time. They don't look like they've changed an awful lot either, to be quite honest. Are you, how are you guys doing with your pack luck? Are you guys spending any dough on packs these days? Are you buying anything these days? Um, I, I do find these uh, these collectibles, the, this kind of idea, I do like this idea because it gives people like me who can't do the events a chance to chisel out of hours. So I might not be able to do an event uh, over a weekend because of work. But it might be that I finish at 6 o'clock on a Monday evening or something and I can sit and I can play for four or five hours um, with, and try and earn the collectibles to, to get one of these uh, special cards, which is um, something that I found quite useful. So more of these, please, for those of us that can't always do the event. Um, shall I collect that? No, no, don't collect the 25 pack. Stupid, you just said they're not good enough. All right, what else? I'll just, just have a look at my uh, my deck again so you can see uh, the strong cards that I do have. I am going to pro, or I'll, 
uh, combine, fortify these Bret Harts at some stage. I've just sat on them for the time being because it took me ages. It took me absolutely ages to get a uh, SummerSlam 21 Pro. Now it's not so bad. There's a few in there. I don't know if you, uh, you probably did notice, but this, a lot of the singles um, uh, match the pros from the uh, Forge tier. If we go down to uh, some of the pros. See here, look, Roman Regains. He's uh, a forged, he's an F1. He's an F1 driver. And there you've got uh, Samoa Joe sat above him. So I don't, it's not normally that strong. They're not normally that much stronger. Again, Shamus, single Shamus, better than an F1 triple her. So I don't know if uh, that was just because we're coming to the end of this season and they thought, um, let's make it that people just joining the game have got a better chance of progressing if they can get up to the top tier and get, um, get some of these single cards. I'm not sure what the thinking was behind that. Um, but it was... Um, it's quite interesting. It's quite interesting because normally uh, there's, there's, you have to pro the new tier to get better than a pro from the old tier. Stands to reason, but not on this occasion. So I don't know if that's something they're going to continue in future. Uh, one of the things that does blight my uh, catalogue in as much as they're clogging up my catalogue is when I get things like this and this from uh, different events that they do or different seasonal different seasonal things that they do is if I've got the single I can't I can't chew it up I can't dust it I've got to keep it um, until I get the chance to get a pro and it may be particularly when you're obviously talking the top tier it might be some time if not years before these start appearing in lower cards in Road to Glory or some nonsense like that um, but I can't help myself because I just want to try and get the pro. I think in, in terms of actual uh, cards, I think it's knocking around the 8,000. Look at that, 8,059 in the catalogue. <laughs> Let's have a look at every image I've got in the catalogue. Let's do it, shall we? No, no big deal. Let's not do that. Right, I think I'm going to love you and leave you um, after that. Let's just have a quick look here. Uh, I need to play some games to power up for that. I'm getting quite a bit of success now. In uh, it always happens at the back end of it here in um, King of the Ring. Uh, Event-wise, how are you finding Stomping Grounds? I've not played it. I don't think uh, Team Bad Lad has actually played it yet. Um, I think they're too busy doing uh, TBGs, so I've not seen it in action. I've not seen it in action, so I've not had a chance to try it myself. So. How are you getting on with that? Um, but also the main events. The main events. I do I do like the fact that they've given you a chance to do things like Road to Glory on an automated basis until you get into the later rounds when it gets a bit tricky and you've got to start um, taking care with which cards you're playing. So that does make it a bit easier, uh, particularly for somebody like me, if you're sat here working away, you can just sneakily like... <coughs> not spit all over your keyboard. I'm talking about just have a little tap. A little finger tapping, a quiet finger tapping friend in the background, just while you're doing some work. So I could be writing something, and I can just go, oh, okay, and just uh, tap it, let it play itself for a bit. Um, but then that's not really playing, is it? That's kind of churning through something as a chore. It's not an enjoyable thing, um, and that's my biggest beef, I guess, with a, a lot of these um, events these days. It's not. I'm not just talking about Supercard now. I'm talking about most games. If you really want to get on, you've got to dedicate so much time to it. And there's a whole world out there. Now, a few of you have been asking about Ninja Boy. Ninja Boy's doing really well, thanks very much. He did start playing the game again around March time for a good couple of months and got himself up um, to just below Forge tier. And then he stopped. And he's in his mid-teens now. He's a big lad. He's not just a growing lad. He's already a big lad. And he's, he's got fun things to do. And another thing as well, weekends, if I do get a chance of a Saturday off, we go to the football. We go out. We're following the Hammers. I'm following West Ham uh, out and about, so uh, which is, I can assure you, not always pleasurable. <laughs> Don't always get the result we want, but it's a good day out. And uh, for those of you who remember Ninja Boy, the very early videos, when he was this, he was about this tall, so a tiny squitty thing with this little high pitched voice. To now have him uh, either stood next to me or sat next to me, singing bubbles out, oh, I'm blowing bubbles. You wouldn't recognise him. You would not recognise him. 
Anyway, people, that's it from me. Thanks ever so much for watching. You know what to do. If you want to see some activity, um, Twitter's the place where I'm still doing a little bit of tweeting out when I'm playing the game. That's the one place where I can say hello now and again. Might be another video coming up soon. I don't know. Not making any promises. But thank you ever so much for welcoming me back into your homes and onto your phones and your devices and your TV screens and everything else. Sorry it's been a while. Till next time, you stay a cool. People say to me all the time, hey Johnny Wrestling, what does it take to become a winner? Those people, I say, try watching Bad Lad Dad's latest video. He'll show you just what it takes to become a WWE Supercard Champion.